would never expect to see any particular thing in any particular year any more than I would expect someone to tell me what the stock market's going to do in a day. That's far too short a time horizon. And if you're going to invest in the stock market, you should be there for at the very absolute minimum five to ten years. And basically, you should commit, you should commit yourself to doing it for a lifetime. So don't worry about near-term forecasts. I never make sector bets. Uh, there's no point to it. You know, one one day it's, we know that you know some of the growth industries will be uh, technology, healthcare, for example, energy. Uh, they will all grow, but we don't know whether the stocks have overvalued them or undervalued them. So I'm an all market man. Hold everything, uh, and you will get the market's return if you do so at low cost. No sectors. Well, the investment community was very dominant, nationally dominant here, you know, in terms of intellectual leadership at the, as the profession of, of uh, security and analysts began. Uh, and we had some great professionals in our trust companies and a few in the investment companies here that were much, much smaller then. And uh, now I don't see the same depth of leadership. We've had a few good leaders along the way. Uh, but today, it's a challenge. And... Uh, the community has pretty much gone to Boston and New York. The banks are not here. Their trust departments used to be quite large and a big contributor to the Philadelphia community. So now we have to rely on firms like Vanguard, which is the big elephant in the room. Probably 80% of the assets in the Philadelphia area are under our uh, supervision. But we do mostly indexing. We, we have a few security analysts, but not very many, because when you match the index, you know you're going to get some good stocks, and some bad stocks, and it will average out over time. And that theory is demonstrably true. What's going to happen is, is the financial industry is going to shrink, and that will be much more of a difficult thing for Boston, for New York, uh, probably for San Francisco, uh, Chicago, and places like that. Uh, but we will make up for that growth here by our strategy, which is so, so unique in the fund industry. Well, the most recent book I actually wrote is called Clash of the Cultures. And uh, it's about uh, the triumph of short-term speculation over long-term investment in our financial system, which doesn't do anybody good except the croupiers in the system. Wall Street, you know, Wall Street loves trading. Uh, the more activity, the more profits they make. It's just like the state lottery. If you win, it's great. The odds against doing so are enormous. Or going out to Las Vegas, and going into the casino with, by definition, less money, coming out with less money than you went in, in with, you as a group. So uh, we've got to get costs out of the stock market. We've got to bring simplicity back in.